We're here at the United States Powerboat Show and we're speaking with Nick Harvey. You're the brand director for Wellcraft and we're on board the 355. Or is it a yacht? Is it bigger? Or is it a yacht? Or is it a boat? What is it? What do you think, John? <laughs> I, uh, I like to think that this, this, uh, this new Wellcraft is a yacht. Um, definitely positioned in the segment of adventure boating. Uh -huh. I think everybody has, has noticed that it's a segment that's, uh, that's really growing uh, uh, here in North America and a lot of other places around the world. And uh, we thought that the Wellcraft brand would be the perfect brand to carry a project like that here at Group Beneteau. We moved back to the cockpit and the first thing I'm looking at is substantial grab rails, triple engines. These are 300s, but they can go up to 350? These are actually 350s oh, and you can they? go down to 300s. <laughs> But yes, triple engines are standard. And you were mentioning how substantial all the grab rails are and yep. everything. That's coming straight from the DNA of Wellcraft. And so we wanted to overbuild it in mm -hmm. every department. And there's double dive doors, easy on off access from dock or water. That's exactly right. You mentioned the wraparound dash, which is substantial, combined with the seats. I totally see the adventure concept that you were talking about. Yeah, you need to be sat comfortably. You mm -hmm. need to make sure that uh, you know you're going to be safe. Um, mm -hmm. So we've obviously got the bucket seats with a with you know the pop-up bolster if mm -hmm. you wanted to drive the boat standing up, which you can. So with a triple 300s, um, we expect to be going at about 45 to 46 knots top speed, and with the triple 350, we go over 50 knots of top speed. If you do want to spend the night. I see amenities for that as well. And the first thing that hits me is how roomy uh, and well lit, and I'm looking at natural sunlight, no lights are on um, down here. Did you design it to, to have all the sunlight come through? We wanted to make sure that we could provide a very roomy and comfortable cabin on this commuter style boat. The bed has two positions, a day position and a night position. So we designed a head um, that has a separate stand up shower with mm -hmm. over six feet of headroom and you'll also notice that there's a lot of headroom in the cabin itself. I guess John must be hiding somewhere around here on the bow of the Wellcraft. Okay, now you <laughs> pick that spot. Well, there's so much room up here. Isn't that one of the best spots on the boat or what? This is the, this is the lounge area. I love this bow. It's got the big loungers. It's got this rear facing seat right here that you can have a vis-a-vis -vis conversation. This has a lot of storage underneath. Uh, we can actually store a table with a table leg so that you could have a comfortable al fresco mm -hmm. cocktail hour up front here. And multi-purpose. Absolutely. So we've integrated some cup holders mm -hmm. on the back side of that flip back cushion and it gives access to an extra hatch in the cabin so that you can get cross ventilation in that cabin. This is a boat as a Swiss Army knife, Nick. You can do anything in it. We want you to go further uh, with this boat than you would on, on any other boat. We definitely want to elevate the entire Wellcraft brand and, uh, and, and bring back all the shine that this brand deserves. Can't wait to see it. Well, thanks very much for coming on board today. Thank you.